Oluwase Olu had the type of debut that teams want from their imports. There is the chance, though, that he won't be able to do an encore. Already without Asi Tolava and coach Yang Giao, who are on Philippine team duty in the Asian Games, NLEX could be without their monster of an import on Sunday when it squares off with Northport, formerly Globalport, in the PBA Governor's Cup at Eners Center in Antipolo City. You can see he was all out with half a leg not functioning, said NLEX assistant coach Jojo Lastimosa, who temporarily took over the coaching reins from Giao. He really wanted to win for the team. The Road Warriors, who also have been without injured guard Kevin Alas and suspended rookie Kiefer Ravina, are set to replace Ash Aolu, who could opt to sit this game out. That gives the Batang Pier a bit of a leverage to get their campaign off to a good start, especially if import Rashid Woods hits his stride. Ash Aolu had 33 points and 23 rebounds as NLEX toppled the TNT Catropa, 103-90, Friday night. But the Nigerian-Canadian import hasn't recovered yet from a torn patella tendon suffered during a tune-up with Miralco two weeks ago. The Bat Tang Pier will also miss a key player due to the Asian Games as star guard Stanley Pringle was loaned to the national squad that is currently hunting for gold in Indonesia. But they can readily take advantage of the Road Warriors' import woes with the six foot five woods expected to create matchup problems all over the floor. The Moralco Bolts will also shoot for a second straight victory opposite the Catropa in the other game after a valiant come from behind triumph over Colombian Dip, 109-106, in the opener Friday night. Alan Durham showed flashes of his might with a near triple-double performance, but it took the veteran smarts and creativity of point guard Baser Amer for the Bolts to notch their first win. I expect us to be in game shape and get better as the conference wears on, said coach Norman Black.